Hey guys, welcome to Farm Simulator 90 on Oakfield on Seasons. So, if I sound a little plugged up, I just had a sneezing fit, so hopefully I don't sneeze. Reality is I probably will. So I now sound very congested and all that good stuff. Anyway, I've got a video. I don't know if it's gone live yet or when it will go live for the tractor show that me and Bill went on on Sunday. Me and Bill's T-Max. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that. If you guys have seen it. If not, stay tuned for it. And hopefully you will enjoy it. It took a almost... Wow. An hour, over an hour to render, so it took a while. Anyway, let's fire this up. I did see the mods that dropped on Friday. Friday was the day we headed down to Seabook. So we'll get this thing in that field. And after that, I think we are ready to go into winter. Uh, we will be looking to sell our crop off today, right now. So, look forward to getting some of that gone and some of our money up. That will be very, 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 very beneficial. Alrighty. So, this is field 29. Let's see. Cool plow. There we go. And first waypoint, which... That's not going to show us there. It's all the way over there. First waypoint, drive course. Alright, that can go on its way. Okay, so. What we shall do now is find our truck. There it is. We'll go hit, hook it up to the trailer. Now, if you guys remember the horse pack updated, it's got that weird, weird trailer lift thing, which uh, I really don't think it's working properly, personally. But we were using that in one of the videos, or well, one of the live streams, actually. And we kept the trailer, basically. Um, this trailer's awesome. It really is a decent trailer, so we're keeping that. Unfortunately, it would appear that the hookups don't... It has no hookup, so I'm interested to see if I get um, Lisa Man Truck or something to see if it has the issues then, or whether it's just this. I don't know. This trailer does hook up with other stuff, so i got a feeling probably doesn't hook up to this for whatever reason. I don't know. Whether it's even supposed to hook up to this, presumably so. Also, I don't know what this truck's going to be, or this trailer's going to be like. Fully loaded with this truck going up hills and inclines to get our best price for stuff. Now, we're not going to rinse through every think right now. We're definitely going to take a load in. Right, line it back up. So, after the... Uh, show, which was a good one. I, I imagine after I'm done this video, to be honest, I'm probably going to throw up the um, video for you guys. It was, it was a genuinely decent day out. I enjoyed it. I've got sunburned to live in crap. But it's not, it's not as bad as it was when I went fishing that time, but I'm sunburned. Pretty damn good. Didn't have any sunscreen to put on. Which I should have had. That's for sure. Alright, hilltop is always the best. So we'll mark that and uh, regret our choices because it's probably not going to go up the freaking hill. Uh, if it doesn't, then I'll uh, look again at Tatra and. Well, at least Tatra for now. Uh, what was that actually we were doing? Uh, what was Canola? And hopefully, I'm fingers crossed this thing can take it up. Uh, if you guys remember, I ended up uh, messing around in the X miles of this truck. Why did it? Oh. It would appear it is not a central storage. Like I first thought. Son of a. He he he. That's separate storage. That sucks. So I've got to go down to the other yard. Um, oh, I lost my train of thought, though. Yeah, the logos are different. I think that's what I was saying. 
Um, basically, I've got in the Alice Mod Company stuff, which I will probably start using at some point. There's a seed maker, and there's some other stuff in there for making silage and stuff like that. So I, th I don't know if I'll, I'll do the silage. I kind of like the idea of making a pit and using the pit first, or having a pit and using that. So I'm not too sure if I'll go down that route yet, but we'll see. Because that's going to take away from seasons. No, no, actually, then I was talking about the uh, trucks. If it doesn't go up the hill, we'll get probably the Tatra. Um, as some of you remember, I have messed around in the XML of this truck and given it basically the identical setup to the man truck that's in game. Way over horsepower for this thing. I don't like it having so much horsepower, but it's to make it more usable. And to be honest, I haven't turned it back from the way I initially had it, where I only gave it a tiny boost. So it's, it's rocking whatever horsepower that truck is, which I think is something like 500 odd horse. It's up there. I did not know these were separate. That kind of sucks, actually. Uh, I'm not going to lie, that kind of sucks, because we got a lot of crop in this. That's fully loaded. Off to hilltop we go. Forty-four point one tons. So actually, a proper, a proper loadout for these trucks. Or well, for this truck, at least, this would be actually road legal. Yeah, it may be. It may cope okay though. Going up the hill. It may actually do okay. Uh, we can go either way. We can do the tight corners or we can just go up the main farm entrance, which I think we're going to go up the main farm road. It's just straight shot up there, loaded on cruise control, build as much speed as possible. It would appear I've got traffic switched off to. I don't know why, but I do. So if I do, it's going to stay off for the time being. I don't recall ever switching traffic off, but apparently I have. I haven't seen any traffic. That was my turn, wasn't it? Oh no. Beautiful. That was my usual turn. We've got to love the colours of the autumn coming into the game. Yeah. It feels like I've not played this for a For a while. And... I haven't. <laughs> it's It's been recent I've played it. Alright, cruise on. Alright, build up that speed, build up that speed. We need all of the speed, Captain. Give her all she's got. I don't know why I went Scottish her. Come on. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. It's right up here, it usually just completely falls on its ass. But it's doing it. Oh, no. There it goes. It's gonna start spinning. That's the thing is, it just winds me up this. I love this truck. I really love this truck. But it makes me go, should I just get rid of it and get the Tatra? I don't want to keep having to lease the Tatra. Or should we have the Tatra down at the stool. Oh, actually, we're gaining traction now. We're on the mud. I say mud. The game recognizes this as mud, so. Okay. We're sorted. We made it. I 
There's weeds in my field again. Uh, I think we're gonna need to go spray the field. Herbicide. Yeah, it looks like we'll get be getting on that to them. But yeah, they. Oh, oh, oh! There's a gate there. I've not opened it yet on this game save. The uh, Tatra. I think we'll just be able to go up there all day long. With no issues. I should almost get it and see out of curiosity. But as I said, I, I love this truck. I, I really do not want to swap it out for anything. But if needs be, I guess I could. I'll let you guys make the decision on that. And I got the seed tender which this truck works very well with, and I don't think it works that great with on the Tatra, if at all. So. We'll see. We'll see what you guys say. If I had to get rid of this thing, it's not like I'm going to be using the bed of the truck anymore now I've got the trailer. Or the box. I got it as one unit, although I'm, I'm reality never going to use it. I'm like, whoa! FPS drop, good lord. There was a shader there that I didn't like. Holy crap. So what I'll do is I'll actually lease the Tatra. Out of curiosity, to run the experiment here. Get rid of the green crap. The way this thing unloads is pretty cool, so... Huh? Hopefully I got it. Oh crap, I didn't see how much money we made. Uh, 55,116. Could I, could I cut through this field? Is that field even ours? No, uh, technically not. Technically not. Now right, I'll put, cheat in the money, get the Tatra. Wrong one. And we'll see how it handles it. I've not done the test yet, and I should. It's just out of curiosity on this one. Not even going to screw around with anything. What is the option of that? Or is it just that? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's only six grand to rent it. That's not bad, actually. And GS. C. Now, it's not like I'm doing this out of benefit or profit. It's just we're in the experiment on camera so you guys can see. And what's the better truck, I guess? Six wheel drive compared to uh, four wheel drive. I I'd say this is going to do better. Let's be honest here. What I can do is I can just drive this down to the... Uh, secondary storage, I guess, and then we'll go from there. Miss my turn again. Could I actually go all the way down? No, I can't. That would lead me to nowhere fast at all. Oh, I guess I should have said this at the beginning of the video. I'm not 100% if I will be streaming tonight. I hope I am, but I'm not 100% as it is a long weekend, so... Over here, so people are going to be off work. Okay, well, okay, just as mum's going to be off work. I don't know if we're going to get up to anything, so... I may or may not be streaming. I do not know. Keep an eye on your notifications. That's all I can say on that one. Hopefully I can. I imagine I'll be able to. Why on earth did I switch traffic off? Oh, 
Oh, I know why I switched traffic off. It was the trailer lifter was just way too wide with all that hooked up. That's right. Yep. Yeah, I completely forgot about that thing. It's a neat unit. It really is a neat unit. It's a shame it's so broken in the game. Unless I was doing something wrong for the tra tracks not to move or slide across the ground. Well, I say slide across the ground. That's what they were doing. For them to roll across the ground and just literally slide and act like they were locked up. It was really peculiar. Didn't seem legit at all. Canola. Alright, this will be the final load of this. Pull that down. I was going to park there, but that's kind of a st very steep incline. So I think we will decline that parking spot. Oh, how was. Jeez. There we go. How was that go? Oh, wow. Halfway through the field? And the Tatra. Oh, wow, that takes a long time to start. Tatra seems higher than it used to be, too. I've not actually used the Tatra in FS19 yet. I don't think. I really don't think I have. I'll test once we're near the yard to see if this thing does work with the horse seat tender. If it does, then I'm very, very tempted to say we'll swap over to the Tatra. It's so different too because I've been using that over truck on everything. Nice sound on this truck actually. With the extra lights up top there, this thing, if it had a snow blade or snow plow thing that could get hooked onto it, it look, actually look really legit as a snow plow. Yeah, no pipe hookups. To be expected. To be expected. So it's 46 ton of the truck, because the truck weighs 10.7 ton. That's what I want to see quick, actually. So if I take off four-wheel drive, what wheels are going to spin? Hmm, I think it's still four-wheel drive. Do we have any lights that come on the dash? Eh, nothing crazy. This mark is a bright. Oh. Can't hear the clicking inside. Don't know if that's just me or not. So this video is probably going to be fairly short. And Jess and her mum and her cousin, well, yeah, cousin, went out to the beach today. Not my type of thing. Got zero interest in going. Especially after catching the sun yesterday. It's just no, not my thing. I rather be productive in other ways. Wish I was high that. Like I said, the Steam Show video. I worked on that and got that rendered uploaded I just need to make a thumbnail for that and go from there the well I mowed the grass
sorted the pond out, got the pump going again. Well, I say going again, but flowing better. And now we're here. So I've had a productive day. So I got a feel I've really got a feeling this truck's just gonna cope way better than the other one. It is losing, losing speed around the same sort of area though. If needs be I will put diff locks on. But I won't do that until it starts slipping just to keep it about the same. Well, that's already past where it was. It's starting to pick up speed now, I think. Yeah, that kicked fine. Hmm. We've got one more test for it. If it passes that with flying colours, then I think we uh, may have a new truck inbound. If I remember correctly, in 17, this truck really did not like the horse seed tender, though. Like, it just looked weird, like it was clipping through, basically. Doesn't seem to want to be building speed much, though. doesn't. The hilltop stores are always the most profitable to go to, yet to get there, you just feel like you're getting really screwed over. And up we go. This is a thumbnail as well, just in case. Fit five thousand one hundred and sixteen this time, it was seventeen. However, this time around, if we can get cut through the fields, I think we shall cut through the field. Especially as where, well, we park this thing and where we want to go as far as testing out that, and that's probably where I'll call it for the day. And I'll start to say, well, those guys are at the beach, and I've got zero interest in going to the beach, so. They went there. I could get crap done here. And I don't know when they'll be back, so we'll just make this shorter than normal. I don't think any of the gates would be open. Someone will go this way. No cows yet on here anyway. Oh, that gate's open, sweet. No cows on here anyway, so... Golden as far as that goes to. Alright, where is the horse thing? I've got a feeling I put it away. And if it's where I think it is, I put it in such a way it's going to be a pain in the ass to get it back out. Yeah, I did. This doesn't have a hookup needed to get it out. Alright, will this thing work? And yes, yes, the controller is still playing up for me. The uh, right bumper button. When I want to jump into the machines, I'm jumping out of machines, which is wonderful. Beautiful. Low, up. Low this, so it's actually got room there. Yeah, I'll take it up here. I 
Really, I should keep this thing up here, it'd be damn sight easier. Move away so it's not going to interfere with anything. Back into the truck. Tatra chassis are so damn unique where their drivetrain is. Engineering in them is insane. And... We've got ourselves a new truck, I think, guys. Yep. Let me know what you guys think, but I think uh, we're golden. It's clear and everything. It seems to be working okay. It looks actually pretty good on it too. So, uh, you guys will have to let me know on that one. Be interested to see what this is like fully loaded down too. Alrighty, so, I'm going to bid you guys farewell for now. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Like I said, I hope you guys enjoy the Steam Show one. I think I'm going to make that live now, actually, after this. So, catch you guys whenever I stream next. Like I said, not sure if I'll stream tomorrow. Not 100% on my one. So, until next time, catch you guys later. See ya.